Hello all, Project Wargaming here with an update on some sales that I've been working on for my Black Sea models. I didn't want to use the card sales that come with the, um, the models. I actually wanted to do some 3D printing um, and use the sales for that. I just thought it might be a little bit faster. Of course, with all the 3D printing and messing around with the, the models, it probably isn't. But um, this is kind of the original version. I actually got the original models off of a Wargaming 3D. I think they're even for free on Wargaming 3D. And then I went in and kind of modified them a bit. I added in some of these ties here, reefing ties. I've also added in the base because in the original models, they didn't have the base on there because this can sometimes really break very easily um, because of how how it works in resin and it being fairly small. Um, so what I wanted to do was play around with the, the resin mixes and see kind of what might work better for the sales. So this is an example of Elegoo Mars and just the straight up resin. So you can see it'll bend, but not super bendy. This is got 60 or 60% 60 Elegoo, um, uh, or no, this is 75% Elegoo resin, and this has 25% uh, uh, tenacious in it. So a little bit more bend to it. You can see it a little bit more in the, the actual model down here. And then this is 40% uh, tenacious. You can definitely see the color contrast between these two, and you can see a bit of the color contrast between these two. So... The more tenacious you add, the uh, wider it'll be, but you can see that it's way, way more bendy. So, uh, which is fine for six millimeter figures and those spears and things like that, but it's not great for the sales. So I think what I'm going to do is do the medium, which is just 25% uh, tenacious. And I think that'll give me a little bit more bounce and a little bit more to a play um, and uh, hopefully the, the models will be a little bit more forgiving. So they'll still break, obviously. It's still a model. It's still resin. So you abuse it, it's going to break. But um, it's just something that I've, I've been pretty happy with and, and satisfied with on how it's going. So I just thought that that would be a good little video to show you the difference and to show you what Tenacious does when you mix it in with your uh, your regular resin. So um, I, it'd be, I would be hard pressed to go more than 40% on any of the models that I would print off. Um, they still work, I think, pretty good for six millimeter stuff. This would be six millimeters that is printed with the, the resin mix there. The spears and everything are very bendy. The horses do flex a bit more as do the the flags on the back of these units and really forgiving in six millimeter figures but just too bendy i think for the sales because eventually i want to put the lines on them and uh and all the rigging and everything so anyways i just thought that that might be of interest to some of you so there you go we'll talk to you later